It is merely half a meter high and wide, and yet is supposed to perform the work of huge conveyor belts, a revolution in moving goods and product components. What is the secret of this little cube? In many companies, especially in the manufacturing industries, a large number of products and materials need to be handled every day. A variety of parts must be moved continuously for further processing, packaging or shipping. The right part must be in the right place at the right time, if a business is to run optimally. Industries so far have mainly used roller conveyors and conveyor belts for transport purposes. However, these systems are rigid and inflexible. As soon as new requirements arise, for instance from other products or product components, the system must be adapted or even replaced completely. While this is being done, the system is down, a costly matter and a waste of time. This is the point addressed by KIT engineers in their new development. The Institute for Materials Handling Technology and Logistics Systems initiated a research project to which a total of 12 industries and research institutions contributed. The result is CARIS, a conveyor system incorporating a brand new approach. In creating CARIS, we wanted to design a conveyor system much more flexible than those existing today. I'm not exaggerating too much when I say that this is like mainframes in a way to PCs. This is exactly what we're doing for conveyor technology. CARIS is a German acronym for Small Scale Autonomous Redundant Intralogistics System. Its core is the cubic module, which is able to navigate autonomously. Each module is able to transport goods either individually or in a compound. In this process, it can freely move in space. The top of the module carries conveyor rollers for goods transport. A traveling gear is attached to the bottom. The special shape of the wheels allows the modules to move in any direction without having to turn. The carrier's modules are able independently to pick up goods, transfer them, transport and deliver them. A novel feature is the autonomous action of the carrier's modules. Depending on the job at hand, the modules can act individually or in clusters. A single small object can be transported by a single module. However, if bigger objects are to be moved or a high throughput is to be achieved, several cubes combine in a cluster. When the task has been completed, the cluster is disbanded and the modules again are available individually. CARIS is a fully decentralized materials handling system. All CARIS modules are able to act autonomously. There is no need for any central control. The core of a CARIS module consists of a computer with highly efficient control algorithms. Additional laser sensors are installed along the sides. These sensors are used by the CARIS module to scan its environment. In addition, they allow precise docking with the respective stations. In this way, the module can recognize obstacles suddenly appearing in its way and can recompute the way to its destination. The modules permanently exchange information about availability, battery charge and position. In this way, all capacities are used optimally. This flexible approach allows businesses to render their production more efficient and, in the long run, cut costs.